On today's video, we're ripping off Popeye's Ghost Pepper Wings. I forgot the eggs. Yeah, I know. Let's go. Here we are, your favorite place. Yeah. You wanna go to the fishing section? No, I just wanna get in and get out. You don't wanna go to the fishing section? No. Man. Something hot. These ain't even hot. We don't need many of these. These are hot enough. You check them? No, I did, man, so that's better. Do the crack check. I only need three. Oh, good. That's good. All right, good. let's get out of here. On today's video, we're ripping off Popeye's ghost pepper wings. I shouldn't say that, should I? That'd probably get a lawyer on us. We're ripping them off. <laughs> we're not ripping them off. We we're making them. Our, we're making our version of ghost pepper wings. We're improving them. Yeah. So, yeah, they're going to be hot. It's hot outside. I haven't ate all day, and the first thing that's going to go into my stomach is ghost pepper wings. So... What about that Michelob Ultra you had on our meeting this morning? That doesn't count. All right, so we're going to do a ghost pepper hot wing, fried. We're going to fry them up in that little $100 fryer I got off of Amazon. And if you guys want to know any, any of the stuff I use, there's a link down below to an Amazon store that we got set up. And then we put a link to everything on there. And we get like a little kickback, like maybe 1%, you know. Maybe over six months we can buy a beer with it, but like nothing crazy. So, uh, but anywho, it's all down in the description. And, and just so you know, this entire recipe is going to be down below in the description. So you can print it off and try it at home. So without further ado, let's just jump right in. Like I said, we're going to be rocking the ghost pepper. So our very first dredge is going to be a dry dredge. And it's going to be <laughs> ghost pepper. Not enough? Uh, yeah, for to kill a grown man. We'll put a little in the last one too. That's about two tablespoons in the last one. All right, first dredge out of the way. Set that aside. Second dredge is gonna be your liquid dredge. Let me grab all this. Like I said, everything's down below in the description. Flour. Secret ingredient right here, club soda. Thank me later. Three eggs. You know the, sh the eggs with the white shells are way easier to crack. You know a little fun fact about chicken wings too. It's actually just a chicken. Just they knock it in the head when it's a little smaller, I'm sure. A hand whisk. Probably should have hooked up the blender for this. Don't you think? The, uh, the old mixer? Yeah. <laughs> Where's that thing at? It's okay. It doesn't help that we bought the cheapest one we could find. No, this, this mixer was about 37 cents on Amazon. But we got a link down in the description in case you want it. <laughs> cake batter yeah but man thank me later thank me later one hundred percent the way you shouldn't use a whisk but huh. all right and the last one this is the good one we have a cornucopia of spices this is a barrage of brilliance ghost pepper Ooh, that's a good one. Get out of there. Like I said, it's all down in the description. And last but not least, flour. Get your other clean little whisker. <laughs> I said whisker. Whisker? Whisker, damn it, kill them. Ding 
Don't, oh, what's in that? You can't see oh. it. Maybe you can look at it in the air. It's gonna kill us. Do that. Crazy, you better not do that. Man, if you guys like hot wings, this is a good one. All right. Do you know when the first commercial restaurant started selling uh, wings? No. It was back in 1994. 94, huh? Yeah. There was an Amish man just outside of uh, Kansas City, Missouri, lived in a town called Carrollton. And um, they sold bread out on the side of the road. Bread, rolls, things like that. And uh, I was out there one day, and I was buying some bread, and I was like, man, you know what would be good with this? Um, he actually, that was waffle day out there. I said, man, if you, did, if you did some, like, wings and waffles, I said, I think it could take off. The rest is history. I'd like to thank Claude, that little Amish man in Carrollton, Missouri, for inventing these. All right. Oh, Claude. Never would have known if it. Claude was a great dude, man. He had a good looking daughter. She's a little bit hairy, but good looking. All right, these are the wings. Boy, these are good looking wings, too. You always got to taste the first one. I'm just kidding. And don't wash these. FDA, man, come on. If you're down in the comments right now going, you got to wash that, man. Come on, man. Google. Google something. All right. I'm gonna get these wings dredged up and then I'll see you down at the cooker. Here we go, you ready? Okay, first one. Oh. Turn the heat up a little bit. Yeah, Look. fat little rig. Are you a leg man or a flat man? Uh, and honestly, I like the flats better, I think. I do too. I think I do. Get your crispy. Ooh, no. What's the. Man, that doesn't suck. That's pretty good, huh? It's got a little bite to it, though. So hey, as you can tell, this is a super easy recipe. And uh, if you wanna try this at home, like I said, go down in the description below, print off the recipe and try it because it is fantastic. Hey, I wanna thank you for watching. Don't forget about our giveaway, the very first link down in the description. Click on it, go over there, get signed up, and you never know, you could be our next winner. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace. That is so thinking good, man. Ready? Let's hear it. <laughs>